This is all happening right now this morning. So, I mean, as you are tuning in to us, we're just now getting this information in. A couple hours ago, the initial quake first thought to be an 8.9, then dropped down to an 8.6. Now we have reports of an aftershock that would be an 8.8. .8. And remember, these numbers are often adjusted because they get the initial readings, then they get in and they look at it. Now, so two separate things going on, the earthquake and then the aftershock. And now we actually have to talk about the fear of a tsunami because there are, and we're immediately tsunami watches, warnings, and advisories put out by the Pacific Tsunami Center. Now, a buoy that was located in that area did see a little sea level rise. There has not been an initial impact of a tsunami anywhere, and that's because the USGS says at first, this first earthquake was more of a horizontal slide, and it makes total sense because the other kind, that vertical slap, if you put your hand in a bathtub and you slide it sideways, you just don't move the water very much. If you push it like this, that vertical way, then you're going to create a wave, even in the tub, and that's exactly the same thing that happens with the tsunami. So they immediately took everybody off the coastline in the areas that were affected. They put out a tsunami watch and warning for about 28 countries uh, right now across the entire Indian Ocean.